guys welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you on how to uh, package sniff using wireshark network analyzer tool all right and uh, yeah let's quickly begin with the demonstration and before that i just like to add few points here so in your school uh, your school teacher perhaps would have taught you uh, and advised you not to visit nefarious websites containing http traffic okay the https uh, tra uh, websites are secured using an ssl certificate that allows the data or information traveling through that website uh, to stay certificate protected using encryption standards okay basically that's so, uh, website becomes an ssl protected certificate to protect your uh, uh, your protect the information available on the website okay to stay secure without any data leaks however when it comes to accessing http websites those are generally nefarious uh, in a sense that uh, when we inspect the packets the s clandestine information can be unveiled using wireshark utility so that is one of the uh, positives as well as negative if you talk about positive uh, Wireshark utility can be uh, used by network administrators particularly in organization to troubleshoot uh, any sort of network issues due, due to a packet loss okay maybe perhaps and on the other hand uh, a negative to talk about is that uh, if this utility goes into a hands of a wrong person like an attacker okay attacker can use this utility to eavesdrop to the network and unveil some of the clandestine uh, information like username and pass wd okay so this is what i just wanted to uh, add or highlight uh, before i begin with the actual demonstration okay so let me quickly launch wireshark in front of you So I have, I'm going to just select this interface, ETH0, all right, and start capturing the packets now, right? You can see here, the packets are getting captured. All these are packets in front of you, shown. And now I will also quickly begin my uh, browser. I will launch my browser and establish a session, okay? So when I say uh, how an attacker uh, eavesdrop onto a network to unveil some of the uh, clandestine information like username and uh, and pass wd, I'm just going to show you now how it does how an attacker does that. Okay, so that's why always there is a cyber security awareness programs teaching students and it professionals to stay away from all these um, all these dangerous elements within the it environment okay so you need to make sure you never visit nefarious websites okay so this is a virtual machine i can safely do it okay also there is this website right test php dot vulnerable web dot com forward slash login forward slash dot php this is a test website guys this is absolutely safe to use there is no harm in visiting this website this is just a test vulnerable website used by security penetration testers for learning purposes okay and what you need to do is i have visited this website all right the packets and the traffic would have been logged by the virtual security and the username is test and the password is also test right and i will just say don't save to this pop-up all right and this is successfully logged in i have logged on successfully to this web uh, website test p uh, php dot v uh, world web dot com okay and as you can see here the red log strike up log symbol which ensure um which denotes that the website isn't uh, uh certificate protected so you can see your connection is not secure here okay now let's quickly go to the uh, wireshark packet capture utility and what we will do is we will just type tcp contains uh let's say you name okay and i will hit enter 
as soon as you do that you can see guys this is the packet that is that has been successfully captured by the wireshark tool all right and what i'm just going to do is it's automatically it has uh, went to the browser session this is the application layer where the where the packets that we are going to inspect just now this these are the packets guys okay as i have uh, demonstrated in my other um video too on wireshark and uh, once we come down below over to here i have just uh glided the slider down below to the extreme uh, bottom corner and as you can see here all these packets constituted this web page logon okay and as you can see here guys it's clearly highlighting the u name which is test which is equal to test and the pass wd over here is equal to test so i have easily unveiled the u name and the pass wd without any uh, hiccups so basically it was very easy just because this is a nefarious website uh unencrypted website or whatever you can call uh, or unencrypted traffic the wireshark uh, utility was easily able to intercept uh the web page and uh, strip down the packets to uh provide this kind of information clandestine information to you over to you okay so this is not a harmful thing to me so i am a i'm a i'm a good actor here but if it goes on to a bad actor uh he can definitely exploit this in a bad i mean in an in a negative intention so basically this is for awareness purpose uh of awareness purposes i would say and uh, please ensure that you never visit nefarious websites containing http rather than https https websites are always safe to visit and secured by a, a ssl certificate wherein this http websites aren't certificate pro uh, protected so all the information uh that you are uh, sending and receiving it's all um unprotected message okay and easily uh it is a human readable message rather a encrypted message so it's always as advised it's uh you must not visit nefarious websites so that is what uh, the whole purpose of this video was and uh and and somehow you you must have also gotten an understanding on how to uh inspect pra uh packet captured via this wireshark utility and if you found this video helpful please hit the upvote button and do not forget to subscribe my channel we will meet in the next video with more useful content like this all right thank you and stay safe cheers tata